and welcome back to another day in the arena. It's me, it's CGB, and I am here on the official Magic the Gathering Arena YouTube channel, and I'm excited to announce that I will be here on a weekly basis on Saturdays going forward for the foreseeable future. So make sure that you hit like and subscribe and check back for more videos from me on Saturdays. And today I'm going to showcase a deck that was played by username Noob. I doubt it, considering the fine composition of this beautiful list. But username Noob used this on Magic the Gathering online in the challenge. And in my opinion, it was the most unique and innovative deck to make the top eight. So huge congratulations to the player. And this is a blue-black control deck designed to attack the meta with deadly cover-up. The Collect Evidence board wipe coming out of murders at Karlov Manor. The Collect Evidence part where you get to go through your opponent's graveyard pick a card and then go into their library and take out all copies of that card makes this card useful even against decks that don't rely on creatures and it tips the scales for demir control against other types of control decks like blue white control or ramp that are very very popular these other board wipe centric decks can't dive into the opponent's library with their board wipe and remove the key win cons like jaces and wandering emperors and atroxes and things of that nature but deadly cover-up certainly can so is blue black the better control deck for the meta we're going to put it to the test in my favorite format which is best of one the deck's win cons are sparse but effective one copy of aklazots for those decks that have trouble killing the giant back god two copies of jace to completely empty the opponent's library after sufficiently destroying all of the cards that they ever loved and hiding in the mana base is a copy of Mirix and three copies of restless reef if you want to play best of three, you can go to the sideboard where you can have more Jace, more Aklazots if those are the right cards, or you can switch to a Seed Shark strategy. So I think that we're well equipped to battle all kinds of decks, which makes this deck a best of one candidate in my opinion. So let's dive in and let the nonsense begin. On the play, we have the deadly cover up, the one of Aklazots and some early plays to get us there. So that's a keep. Dinos. And is that War Leader's Helix? Perhaps a Boros deck. Or a blue white control deck, of course. We have Deduce. A little control mage showdown never scared me. Draw a card, investigate. Deadly cover-up is so cool because it's one of those rare board wipes that isn't useless in a matchup against other control decks. You can use it to take their win cons out of their graveyard. Meticulous Archive. Ooh, ooh, put something juicy there. Put something juicy there. Help me out. Do it. They're thinking. March of Otherworldly Light. Taking that can make the Restless Reefs more likely to hit. It's definitely not the most important card against us. We don't offer them a lot of targets. Get the Demolition Field down. I doubt they're just going to power up a Restless Anchorage, but you never know. Now they have a Field of Ruin. They might have no more lies for this, but you have to go for it. This is usually the sign of a no more lies to come as they activate the Field of Ruin. Yeah, most, most control players can't resist that play, and it's okay. Let's drop this Aklazots and see if the opponent has the answer. Unfortunately, they do, but we do get an open crack at them here. Unfortunately, they took out our Reef, and we don't have much we can do. Deadly cover-up is close to using evidence, but it's not there. Let's see what we draw. No actions from the opponent. Crack our clue. They might use their field of ruin on one of our fields. Ooh, Jace. What do you think? Right now we can play Jace around and no more lies. I think we go for that. Definitely don't need both of these.
Hi. Hi there. I'm Jace the Perfected Mind. Nice. The weak minded will be educated in fire. What are they going to do? They might have a get lost, in which case this goes to the graveyard. They can't attack it easily. We can field of ruin their anchorage and cut down their token. I like the idea of hitting a good chunk of their graveyard, but keeping Jace on the battlefield. There we go. Surrender we hit a disruption protocol. To Definitely took a chunk out of their graveyard. That is going to make protecting Jace difficult. I am the Emperor of Kamigawa. But even if Jace ends up in the graveyard, we can do a deadly cover-up. I don't see any Jaces on their end. How are we going to kill this wandering Emperor also becomes a, a question mark. All right, we're going for it. Let's use our removal. Why did I do it in that order? Because I forgot go for the throat can't kill this creature. That's what we call an oopsie. It's okay. It's gonna be okay. They still could have another no more lies. They have 16 cards in the graveyard. They need one more and then Jace's minus could draw three. So let's play around the no more lies. Resolves. They didn't have get lost Save last time. I will keep so let's go like this. This will put a card in their graveyard so the Jace activation becomes a draw three. We can't do it first because of no more lies. We have to do it after. So now there's 17 cards in Graveyard. This should draw three cards. Which I believe is 100% worth it compared to just trying to mill them again. We had another Protocol and a No More Lies, but we don't hit an untapped land. Well, the next steps are going to be to cover things up. Ooh, I hope they blow up the Reef. Ooh, okay. We still don't see any Jaces from them. They might be trying to win off Wandering Emperors alone. Seems unlikely in this meta, but it's possible. Counter over there. Strike fast and strike hard. Move to combat. We might get a No More Lies on our go for the throat. That would be nice. Nope. We're gonna let Jace go to one. Don't understand what's important. And they don't have their own Jace. Okay. Okay. Feels like a good spot to be. Become subdued. Let's go for it. Oh yeah, we're collecting evidence today. There is a Takanuma in the deck that can get a Jace back, so let's leave it. Opponent reaching for counterspell immediately, I think. They need it. We could take their protocols, we could take their emperors. Get lost the Jace. Ooh, they were trying not to do that. Okay. Well, that's the last Jace, so we're not that concerned. If we take the Wandering Emperors, they might lack win cons. If we take the Protocol, they might lack counter spells. But I don't know how many Protocols they run. We see two here. We also see two No More Lies. I'm sure they have four No More Lies, and I'm sure they have four Emperors. But they can't play the other Emperor with an Emperor on the field. Anyway, this is actually a really tricky pick. I'm going to go with No More Lies. Temporary Lockdown, Depopulate Sunfall. All right, do they run Jace? They have one Jace and four de memory deluges that they haven't drawn any of yet. That's very unfortunate for them. All right, get those out. 
So now we have a look. No reason not to play this Celestis. There's one farewell on the deck. So what is our next target? There were no more protocols. <laughs> we could get the Anchorage. Was there more Anchorage? There's only one more. Some people don't like control mirrors, but those are people who usually don't like control. Oh, God. Is there anything better than asserting your dominance in a control mirror as a control player? They're locking down the maps. Yeah, and the timing here is important. They want to do that before they make their own map token. That's what they were thinking about. Makes sense. Make disappear. Unlikely to be super relevant, but you never know. Do we finish the anchorages? Let's do it. While they're tapped out, let's do it. Could also just chonk their basic lands, but there aren't any basics in the graveyard. <laughs> just looking around, just looking around. We still have Siphon Insight. We still have to rest. We have our own Myrix. We have three Field of Ruins. Like it's really unlikely we need to take it out. be a lot better to make sure they don't have that last wandering emperor but how are we going like really how are we getting rid of this wandering emperor i don't even think we are i think this wandering emperor is just going to make the other wandering emperor a dead card now they have it see okay we really would love to hit a deluge in the near future there are not more mirixes there's one field of ruin there is one jace Not gonna be much left for a deluge to take. Twenty cards. We have thirty-three. A Jace is fifteen. So right now, a Jace still pulls them ahead. But there is a chance to get more cards with the cover-up. There's another get lost in there. Uh, yeah, look at that. They're cashing in that Wandering Emperor to play another one. They're getting torn apart and they know it. All right, Memory Deluge on top. Let's see if they draw it. I can try to make them shuffle. They might respond to this with an Emperor. That's okay. This will force them to play the Emperor, because we can take the other one, the last one. Look how good this is against a deck that doesn't even play creatures. It's amazing. They also might get baited into drawing this Memory Deluge by cracking their clue, even though there's not much left in their deck to take. So there's the Emperor. There's the Make Disappear. And we take... What do they not? I should have been taking notes on what they have four of, right? It could be an archive. I know they have a get lost. Deduce, deduce. I think there's at least another deduce, but we want them to cast those. Take the get lost? I know there's a field of ruin. It's interesting. It's very interesting. All right, we get that. Now, win cons. There's a Jace. We can potentially stay ahead of it. That's it. That's all they have.
17 cards to 31. If they use the Jays. Okay, they're drawing here. You're going to see me. I'm coming up with the argument that we don't even draw with our clue, right? Because we want to stay 15 cards ahead of them and they can't win. That's how we're playing this. 30 cards to 15. If they play a Jace, they mill me for 15. I'm at 15. They're at 15. They draw first. They go to 14. We've won the game. We just have to not make the mistake of drawing cards. The other thing that can happen is we can find our Takanuma. We can get back one of our Jaces. We can end the game right there. But we can't be sure that we'll draw into it before they draw their Jace. Uh, let's save that for what I will consider the big fight later. We've won the game. It's just possible we're the only one that knows. Okay, that's a lock. That's an absolute lock. Now, I'll start digging for it. Because they don't have a counter spell for that negate. So we can dig for Takanuma, get back Jace with Takanuma, win the game. They're in range. And they can't stop it. Keep it coming. This is where you want to send your you want to send your opponent a little message. It's like this it's pointless to resist. Keep it coming. We'll find that Takanuma. People can say what they want about control. I love this. I love covering every angle. I love knowing we've won without having actually won yet. Don't need the edict. Don't need any removal. We know exactly what their deck is consisting of. At some point, they might give up. You know what's in your deck? They go for farewell, exiling all graveyards. I mean, do we care? Like, we've been talking about the Jace line. I think we let that go. It's fine. They're still at 10 cards. We're at 18. Murex, let's go. Memory, go for it. They hasten their demise. Seven cards in their deck. They find their field of ruin. What do you know? They let me untap, huh? This is all set dressing. Let's see if we can catch the Jace with this duress and just end it here. Make them feel silly for holding it. Make them always question their choices. Oh, it's not there. Okay. Uh, well, might as well. Go for it. That's not what I need to counter. All we have to do is counter one little perfected mind. They go to five. They go to four. The real life total. Nope. 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 <laughs> nope. There it is. Control dominance asserted. On the play, hand is sweet. We get Celestis, which is always welcome. Memory Deluge, which is always important. Deluge. 
and Jace, which is awesome. What do we got here? Another person doing blue black control, perhaps? Go right at him. Make him have it. They had something. That wasn't it. Celestis is very good to get down. Let's see if they have their own because there's not much artifact removal in these colors. Once the artifact is down, you can't do much about it. They slam their own Jace. Yeah, here we go. Let's see what they do with it. If we draw the land off the top, we can attack the Jace. They mill me and hit my memory deluge. I also have evidence ready. Unfortunately, I can't attack this Jace, but I can play this Jace. It's my turn. Is wasted. Dang. You cannot win. All your hopes Those are the punches I like to throw with the Jace. We got the Realm Breaker. That card would be really nasty. Okay, we both run Deadly Cover Up. It's scary. If one of us ends up with our win con like this Jace in the graveyard, things could go south. We've got a march for my Jace. It's good. Good best of one card. I don't have a land. Let's see if we can draw one. Land. Thank you. Easy. I need some of those dresses and negates. We're getting into a bit of a bind here. You missed land drops. They really mess you up. If they don't make a play here, we get a Celestis trigger. And they saw me miss a land drop earlier, so they know we're digging. Ah, oh, they got their own Celestis. That's very good as well. Murex. Murex into the face of the Field of Ruin. Not able to currently use it. Three mana open. Jace on the battlefield. I want to save the cover up to also blow something up. That would be nice. But it's not absolutely necessary. I don't want to kill this Murex before they get to use it. One, two, one, two, three, four. Okay. That's the plan. We're gonna try to get our memory deluging on. Let the real staring match begin. Ooh. Nasty. Okay. So that's nine cards. 33 to 31. We hit a Siphon Insight. Thank you, opponent. Appreciate you. They might go for another Jace. Or they might be afraid. They're passing. Okay. Here is a Field of Ruin on your Murex. Let's see how you respond. You want to make a nerd? Tap for mana. Okay, their own memory deluge. Deluge. Look, bad pronunciation has been a part of my ability to engage with the YouTube algorithm for six years. Don't ask me to give it up. It's, it's all I've got. Let's see if we can get this countered. If we can, deadly cover up gets really interesting. Hmm, duress and another one. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Show me. Show me what you're cooking. Ooh. So their own deadly cover up is there, which we can take. They have no counter spells. They have their own duress, which I don't think is worth it. I think we take the Jace. And then we hit their memories? Or do we hit the cover up? If they can't hit my graveyard, I'd feel so much safer. Let's take the Jace. It's unclear how many Jaces they have, but we're about to find out. We just have to hope that they don't also get to 
memory delu deluge into another Jace, which my opponents are very good at doing. I'm not good at it, but they are. Mid six. I'm going to do this now. I think they believe I'm going to take Jace. But I'm taking cover up. I don't want them hitting my graveyard. Let's make absolutely sure. I guess we could have exiled a bunch of things from our graveyard that we didn't want taken. That would be next level. I don't think I did that right. But yeah, let's take their cover ups. They have a negate in hand now with a duress. They have one more Jace in their library. They have two outrageous robberies. Aye. Okay, that's scary. Two outrageous robberies. Six basics, two reefs, no more Myrix. Other counter spells? Always take a good look around. Just don't run out your timer completely. No more counter spells, just this negate. And we have to be mindful of the end. The only go for the throat target is the Restless Reefs. So very unlikely we'll need it. We're tapped low. This is an opponent's big turn. We have one Jace and one Takanuma still in the deck. They're going to fire the Duress. They'll probably take the cover up. But we have more cover ups coming. But yeah, I should have left them with a cover up, but use my own like Jace, Negate, and Del Deluge as evidence so they couldn't take anything good. That's what I think I should have done. <laughs> they have a negate. We have to get them. Have to get them to bite with the negate. They're going big. That is fine. Twenty one cards to go. We have twenty seven. We could lose to a Jace. We have two make disappears and a negate. Yeah, I need to replace the go for the throat. I need to turn these card draws into real cards. I need a window here to do it. Like this turn is probably my window. If the opponent plays something I have to respond to, it might sneak through. They duress me again. That's fine. They hit the only other duress. They probably took it off the memory deluge. My hand is a mystery. Let's see what we can turn it, in, turn it into. There's a make disappear. Save the Otawara in the deck. Take a land instead. We can siphon some insight with 17 cards left. Sometimes people respond to this in a very aggressive way. They don't like their things being stolen. Oopsie. Could have been better. It all could have been better. I guess we'll fight that because Make Disappear is going to be a very dead card in the near future. Don't chase me. Don't do it. Give me time. I need the time. Look at him thinking about it. Oh, here's the Takanuma. There is Jace down there. Okay. They hit a robbery. They get the Jace, but they don't go for it. Now we know, or do they? Okay, they're going. We have to hit. 
They have to hit a negate or a make disappear. They saw one of the make disappears. There's still one more make disappear. There's still one more negate. I didn't think they'd be this aggressive. It's kind of wild. All right. Give it to me. Ugh. Cringe. Surrender your mind. 12 cards rest. though. Restless Reefs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Not eight. We don't have enough mana. Still Hey, they got the Jace. They got the Negate. They got the Takanuma, and they got the Make Disappear. 69. Uh, and all the Duresses. They got all the goods. Should have responded with the Deduce, but what can you do now? Okay. Okay, so six cards, 12. This attacks, they go to eight. We don't want to draw, right? Or do we? No, let's not. Man, if I hadn't missed a land drop earlier in the game. Their last Jace. Eight cards to five. They have a reef I can't kill, so we have to play this. Pass. They have one go for the throat. They probably have multiples, but we can't be sure. We really needed like one of those cards to be near the bottom. It didn't happen, did it? They're going for the robbery. They're taking my five last cards. You got it. There's no more counter spells in there. The luck wasn't with me on this one. I'll die as I live. Thank you for not negating that. Ah, control mirrors. You win some, you lose some. <laughs>